Hi, it's Dr. Prometheus here. Welcome back to some more of our Road to the League. I don't know where we left off. It's been a while. I know it was the Seven Oaks game. I don't remember if we played late in town or if it was where. I think it was late in town, but we've only had a couple games since we've played. And well, we've continued some good work in the division. Today, though, we have the Southern League Cup first round. Maybe we can get something there. And then Kings Langley will be playing who's uh, in 20th in the relegation zone. I don't think we played. We played Kings Langley last year, I think. But we're trying to go for a promotion push, and we are we're not too far from it. But, of course, it's one point. We have one game in hand, though. One game in hand. We could. I, I want to put a gap here. We can get something. So without further ado, let's get right into this one. And well, it comes down to the point that, hey, we need to keep on rolling. For the games that I think we didn't do, so we'll, I'll talk about late in town here. We had a 4-1 win, a couple, well, one penalty. I thought that was a penalty by Wed, but a penalty there by Jack Valdi puts it in there and then Two goals in rapid succession to put it away to make it 4-1 late in the 80th, 81st and the 89th. Then we went ahead and played Enfield FC. 2-0, Dylan Price with two goals there. Not anything to kind of write home about. We just controlled that game across the board. Then AFC Dunstable, 3-2. It ends up being a Dylan Price 83rd goal after in the 80th minute. They're able to tie it up, and I just thought we played... Pretty well up top besides Marsh. Marsh had some issues here and there, but I felt like we had a pretty good performance from our other two strikers, and that's what we're kind of trying to see. XG was good. Shots on target was good. We had a lot of shots. Possession was over the top. I mean, we played pretty well against a team that I think is towards the top. No, Dunstable's down there. Enfield's down the bottom. So we had a easier run of games there. In that one so today it's Shaftesbury in the Southern League Cup first round and then Kings Langley and we go on with some mid table to fight in the top table portions there is that one thing I do have to report though is we have all five of our loans in so at this point we are not going to be able to bring anyone in unless we somehow get an influx of cash and i don't see that happening so i think we're going to be tied in to what we have for this season we are projecting a massive loss this year hopefully the board doesn't kill us because they probably will but it happens all right so shaftesbury we're i don't think this cup's going to give us much so it's kind of a cup that I'd like to perform in, but the reality is it doesn't matter. So I just want to see our first crack at, at the Southern League Cup and then, well, you never know. But I don't see us really, even if we win it, it's not a significant cup by any means. Maybe in the grand scheme of things, we get maybe 10 or 20,000, which is okay. But if we actually were to win it all, but it's not really going to help us when we're 197,000 likely projected in the red. So, well, that doesn't help. Cause I didn't put a keeper out here. Dan green goes down. We're going to put in Sulkahan. It don't ask me why we're going to do this. We Thankfully it's a cup game. Bradley's going to put that in and that will be over the net. We can't bring in another keeper. Hopefully it's nothing significant. Oh God, this is so bad. This is so bad. Now I haven't played probably in Four or five days. It was over Christmas weekend portion, so I didn't really put a lot of videos out, nor was I worried about Monday or 
And, uh, I think we had one on Friday, but I kind of took a small little hiatus in a way. Yeah, let's see what we can get back here. So that is over the keeper. Weld is going to, they're going to rule it as Weld got interfered by the keeper. Dolly's going to take this one. Dolly is going to, well, Pittman's going to save that. It's unfortunate that Dowdy can't put it in the back of the net. Bradley from the corner. Can he put it in the back of the net? Look deep here. That is a sea of jerseys there in the middle. Pittman does come up with it, though. All right, halftime. Done well. Let's, let's keep this going. Mark's going to have a corner. If there's a shot, it's going to go, oh my God, he hit the post. I don't believe that. Okay. that That's an easy, easy say for him. Daldi's not having the greatest game right now. Let's take him out and put Isaac in. Up top. Yeah, let's put Isaac in. Up to Hayford. Bring it back. Grizzly is going to cross it back. Come on, Marsh. You got to win that in the air, my guy. Pelai might be able to get something in here, but just not seeing a lot from our starter there that it's probably better to bring him out. All right, the other two subs. Let's take out Hunt. Let's get Hayford back. Frankie Franz, let's get him in. Let's get in Ryan Inskip probably up top for Dylan Price. Oh, we've made that substitution back here. That's right. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. Um, I'm not sure. Yeah, these, these are my five that are going to take the penalties. It's going to come down to penalties. And we have a non-keeper in goal right now. This is going to be interesting. Give me my five. Okay, let's see if the non keeper can do it. I don't think this is going to work. <laughs> I don't know what we're doing here. Price, going to start it. He's going to put it in. We just need a random save from a non-keeper right now or Hall to miss it. It is possible at this level. Oh my God, he made a save. What, what is... <laughs> hey guys, this is not league for you. All right, Marsh, come on. All right, Marsh puts it in. We just need to score two more times or technically three more times. He almost saved that. He almost saved that. All right, Humphreys. Oh, just beat Pittman. Okay. We need two more goals and then we advance the next round and that's going to be the silliest thing. Here's Clark. Okay, inside post. I thought maybe he had some silliness where he hit the post and it bounced this way. 
Okay, here's Wed. Wed puts it in easily. Do we just need one more goal? Or a stop here? One more goal or a stop. I don't believe we got away with this. Sokka. Oh, he almost saved it. He almost saved it. Okay, we need a goal here. Press side. Pull A is coming in. Pull A. Oh my God, what is that? Come on, my guy. All right, sudden death. I don't think. I don't think we, that's the goal we needed to advance. At the end of the day, though, not advancing in this is probably fine just because the sole fact that we can count on the league. Yeah, he's not. Our guy isn't going to stop much here. We need them to actually miss a penalty or that. All right. So that is actually no, because he has a chance. Mackenzie's going to come in. I don't think it's going to matter here. Yep. See. Okay. We get to concentrate on the league and I'm fine with that. I'm proud of the boys efforts. I don't really care about that cup in the grand scheme of things. Would have been nice. All right. Well, here we go. This is the side we're going to be bringing up against King's Landing, King's Landing, King's Langley. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be a bit of a crazy issue. Now, Dylan Price, my coach was saying I should be playing as a poacher, and they're probably right here. We're playing as an advanced forward. So we're going to switch him over to a poacher. Still, he has a good partnership with Marsh. So we should be getting something uh, up top happening more uh, with those guys with their cooperation. Otherwise, let's submit the team back in the table. The only concentration is the table and uh, winning this league. I don't think we're going to be, it's, it's going to be a tall order. A tall task. We're going to need someone to step up for us and goal, which is going to be the biggest thing. We could have some good development, though, from Jimmy Clayton. But you never know. We're just going to have to dominate these games. There's Kennedy. Going to go in for a corner, going deep. Humphreys is going to be there. Hayford is not going to beat Wood there. Plays it up. Hall moving around. Pull him over to Kennedy again. We're marking up decently well. That is going to be a little bit too wide to the left. We get away with that one. Set piece here. This is going to be played probably back post by Wed. We'll see how this is. Uh, he's playing it middle. Kind of back. Daldy with a shot. And he's going to be putting it in from about 18 out. That was a good one. Looked like it'd been a touch right to him. Daldi just had all the time in the world up the top of the box. Yeah, it's it's one. It goes right to Daldi. I think that is a pass by us. I think if I'm not mistaken. Did anyone get a, an assist? Yes, someone did. Here's Kennedy in the corner again. And Howell missed that. Don't ask me how he missed it, but he just completely whiffed it. Kennedy getting over the top, looking, gets it over to Wood, and a stop by Clayton. Great save. Great save by Clayton. Very happy with that one. As Humphreys heads that behind the net. Uh, Adam Hunt had the assist for that goal for Daldi. We're playing decently well. Clayton's got a 7 0. You'll love to see your goalkeeper getting something done. They've had one good shot. Maybe a couple good shots. 
Hayford's going to be Hayford's out. Hayford has his second yellow, which is going to be a red. He's off, and we have to think about what we're going to be playing. Um, let's play Marsh back. Dolly will go to a narrow front with this. Humping a oh, like this, we'll play defensive. We'll also play. When we lose our possession, we're going to regroup. Instead of a high press, we're going to do a mid press. We'll step back a little bit. We're probably inviting pressure, but it's what we can do. Yep. Maybe we can get a point out of this. change it back See if we can get something here off the kickoff Bradley looking not there Humphrey's going deep for a second I thought that was the keeper but no that's the that's the ref Keen taking it down near side this is gonna go badly for us I think at this rate Bradley is going to win it. We could go full defense. Let's go wood being the box to box. Or wood. Wed being the box to box. If Marsh be an attacking mid, uh, an attacking midfielder on support, just play it with that. An unlucky. Who was who's the man that was ejected? Was it Marsh or was it Marsh? Being sent off Hayford is unacceptable. Would demand more from the guys. Keen looking. Bring it around. There we go. We took it. We just don't have as much help as we normally do up here. Just kind of hurting our ability to pass the ball around. We don't have our middle triangle at all. Good long ball. There it is to Dowdy. And Dowdy puts in the back of the net. But we see the flag down here to be offsides that yeah, we just don't have this nice diamond that we have in the middle here which helps us pass to the defense I'm gonna demand more like a couple of subs here Bradley's gonna come out Tolkien is gonna come in I don't want Humphreys out um, what is being absolutely destroyed right now? Let's have Franz come in. He could play box to box. This is Franz being attacking bit. And up top. Actually, let's move Hunt back here. Franz is going to be back here. We'll get Marsh will drop back. And we'll have Inskip come in and play this middle. I 
That's the subs will do. I'm playing cautious. Ah, uh, we're not going to be able to get that in time. Just lack the men to actually play around and rush them. Good stop by Clayton, though. Good stop by Clayton. He's going to get his work today. Kennedy, we need to hold this 1-1 draw. We did win it in the air. Just something. Good movement around. And that's going to be Clayton. Just having 10 men on the field is not something we can handle, obviously, at this level. I don't want to see that. I don't, I don't want to see it. I'm going to demand more. Especially with Clayton being the one there. I mean, he is going to struggle in that situation. And that's just because of the sole fact that If we go down a man, we put Clayton even more in a bubble. And it's not his fault. He's saved 20 shots at this point. You can't save them all. There we go. Oh, come on. And skip. I need something better. Here we go, Franz. Ah, and skip and he's, okay he won it he's gonna make a break oh my gosh he missed it oh come on that has to be on target it has to be on target man that is a struggle Can we salvage a point from this Good ball. Valdi has the speed. And oh my gosh, another great save. We just don't have the personnel to be out here to mark up. Yep. They're easily able to pass it through. There's nothing we can do there. Robbins puts it in. And we put we put Clayton on an island back there. He needs a lot of help. And that does not go with the fact that uh yeah, we failed here today. Hayford failed. I don't like what I saw from this team. Hayford, I'm just disappointed that you got sent off. There's no reason to get sent off in that position. I don't know what the thinking is, but uh, we do have a game in hand that we can climb back above and be in first, but unfortunately, uh, it's not going to help us. Hafer is going to accept this fine, and I think we're going to have we're going to have three games this one. We didn't have an episode today or yesterday, which was Monday, so we're going to have three games for you today—a longer episode. So we're going to play Northwood and we're going to see how this one goes. All right, here's Northwood. And I did look a little bit more at the goalkeepers, but we just cannot, we cannot handle it. So that thinking, we just need someone to step up. Clayton, we need someone to step up somewhere. Because, uh, yeah, it's, it's going to take a lot. Uh, Andre might be a little bit better in some aspects, but I I just don't see it. He's not consistent. So uh, he does have a fairly determined attitude. Same with Clayton. His attitude's not great, but he's consistent. So I uh, can have a trade off. We don't know which one we're actually going to get at this point. So. 
without further ado let's get right into this one and uh yeah hayford's out because of that red card frankie franz is gonna have to come in and play his position and he is just gonna have to like it and we need a win here northwood is actually top portion of the table so i think they're up around five six and with this win I think this is our game in hand at this point, and we'd go up by two points, uh, I believe, at this point. So we need something here. We're going to give a little praise to the boys. Wed from a corner, putting in a lot of traffic. Humphreys, good whip, but misses it. Weston doesn't have to make much of a move there. We hold, actually, the possession is pretty even. It's just their actual shots are on target. That one is going to be one in the air. I thought that could have been a penalty, but let's not let Clark take the shot. Clayton tips it wide. Great save. Great. You got lucky with that one. Clayton can't be put on that island the entire day. Martin, good one. It's going to be headed away. Back Martin again with the second effort and I think that was Akubayan puts it puts it out of uh, out of harm's way a little bit. Bradley with the corner looking and we cannot get a header on it. Naldi is there, plays it over to Humphreys. Plays it back, Franz. Plays it here, looking for the cross. It's not, it has to be a little bit. There's a penalty. Tingley upended Price there before he could get the shot off. That's why it was lacking. Dowdy's going to take the PK. And Dowdy put it in. He will. And we go up 1 0 over Northwood. So, unfortunate series of events for Northwood as Dowdy puts in the penalty. And uh, I don't know what the. I mean, there was contact, but we got away with it. I think we got away with one. Now, Williams trying to set something up here. Tingley was the one the penalty was on. Young plays it up. To De Peppa. Allowing our guys to get back. That's a good cross, and that is going to hit the side netting. I'm going to praise the boys at this point. We've been playing great across the board. Clayton's playing good today. We only got our two out of five shots on target, but well, I mean, we can't say that because one shot on target was a penalty. So at this point, only two shots on target in the actual game. But at halftime, I am fine with that. I like what we're creating. We just need to follow through. That's a big issue is following through and winning these games. Um, I'm going to praise the boys again. Uh, we're going to take out Bradley and probably Greasley at this point. I would like to avoid having anyone else. Here's Marsh. The shot's not there. He's going to put it to Wed and Wed just cannot put enough foot on it. Okay, I'm going to take out Greasley. He is gassed. Tolkien's going to come in. Hunt is going to come in for Bradley. Actually, no. Tolkien is going to come in here. Flip this around. Uh, Franz is going to come back. And we're going to put in... Move Marsh back over here. That's how we're going to play this. In skips the next one in. At this point, let's put in skip in. We're going to put him in for. Let's put him in for price. Price is probably our better finisher. To be honest. Uh, for Inskip, let's put him in for Wed. Let's do that. The Marsh 
and play that position. There we go. That's fine. We're gonna hold this somehow. Oh, come on, there it is. Marsh back to him. Good one. And that is a header. Let's go. Oh, I put it in. I mean, what can you say with that one? Header just by Weston. It gives us a little cushion. So that'll help some. Let's praise the boys. I want to praise them. Clayton makes the save. It is a 7.1 right now. So at least that's helping a bit. Big kick here. Valdi's not going to win it. Playing it wide. That's going to be one though. Franz is there. Good play back to Humphreys. Hunt to Marsh. Bring it up. Price has to take a shot. Marsh get there. He does get a foot on it, but Nicholas does have control. Young. Big burst of speed looking for the cross. He's going to get it, and that's going to be near post. There's nothing Clayton can do about that. Smith just making a good play, cutting in front of the keeper, and just making the play. With those, I mean, as a keeper, I, I feel like you need to play front post there, but your defender has to play front post as well. And this could turn bad if this goes into this situation. The right foot, we need to win the ball. It's what we're not doing, and Nicholas has a great shot to keep her. Clayton. Clayton is there, but the shot is off the mark. I'm going to demand more at this point. I demand more to get them back in the game. Get your head back in the game, boys. Let's hold this lead. Let's hold it. Come on. Oh, God. Football manager, don't do it. Oh, my God, Clayton. Clayton made a save. What a save. Maybe that was a defender, but I'm giving it to Clayton anyway. Come on. Let's clear it. Humphreys clears it. Come on, ref. There it is. Oh, I don't know if Clayton actually made that play, but. Oh, God, Clayton. You did something. 7.1. It was a great win. And we are two points atop. Kidlington. I don't know how we're doing this, but we just need to get ourselves promoted. That is the biggest thing. That is the biggest thing that we need to do. And that means Hayford is going to be back in the lineup. So that's it for Ellis. Hayford's going to come in. And that is how we're going to play here. Now we have a couple more partnerships up top. Developing. One with Marsh and Price and then Marsh and Dowdy. Dolly just needs to get his partnership up with Price, and that'll be good there. A partnership in the middle hasn't started to develop. On defense, there's a decent partnership in the middle, but he'll probably need some time with that. I mean, Clayton, the man came through for us. I don't know what to say. He's definitely not up to this level, but I mean... What can you do? What can you do? I mean, he's, he's came through. He's came through. So now where are we going to come back? I'm not sure we're going to come back. We might come back probably in December at this point. We don't have any cup games. So we don't have to worry about that. Uh, we're starting to get more and more fans to come this season to watch us at the Erie. So there is that. But I think we're going to be back in December sometime i don't know who we're going to be playing but we'll be back then i see how we're doing we'll get through what is this seven games and we'll see where we're at in the table so longer episode for you guys we're going to be skipping around a little bit more this season december 
We'll play some games in January because that's a good one there. February, and then we're talking about winding down to see if we can make the playoff uh, push or win the table. So thank you all for joining me. Go leave a like below, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Later.